Hi, my name is Lisa Skinner, and I am Stephen's wife. Um, Stephen, a year ago, was diagnosed with glioblastoma, which is brain cancer. According to the doctors, with luck, Stephen will have four to six months left with us. So we're trying to make the most out of it. As a kid, he was very inquisitive. Uh, asked a lot of questions, uh, was, was very much a student, uh, both in sports and in educational activities. He had lots of friends who spoke well of him along with uh, adults who knew him through high school and, and traveling around with his, with him, with my dad, uh, and he made friends very easily. So uh, he was a, a very good person to be around, somebody that you would always want to be considered as a friend. I met Stephen in the fall. It was my second week in college as a freshman, and I met him at the United States Naval Academy. Um, we met on his birthday at a dance. Naval Academy had um, socials back then, and uh, my college was invited uh, to the social. And um, I basically um, walked right past them, and he was on his way out of the building, and he turned around, and um, he asked me to dance. And we um, actually talked more all night, and then um, did the last dance actually didn't actually get out there and dance until the very last dance which was called last dance ironically he's not the reason why i applied to the naval academy but i think he's definitely the reason why like when i got my um appointment to the naval academy that i decided that i definitely wanted to go I was reading, mom had some like news, like paper clippings. It was a mammoth from like his like hometown. They like did a little like piece on him, uh, like how he like grew up there and how he had gone to Naval Academy and done his time in the Navy. And now he was like doing all his like business stuff. And I was like, and he was like talking to like these college kids and I was talking about like his career basically. And like I, was thinking like all like the cool things dad has done and that was probably that was the reason I was like okay I definitely want to go to Naval Academy so I'm gonna like accept my appointment. I mean other than father he is a role model uh, like growing up I tried to copy him and I got in trouble a few times where I'd literally follow him and he'd forget something like swear and I would swear and he would recommend me, but I literally was just trying to copy him because pretty much I, I'd watch him do things and he'd succeed. So that's why I picked up basketball. I picked up sports for the most part originally just because he was big in the sports. Um, picked up football my last year because he was the star of his football team. Um, so yeah, it was just really someone to look up to, someone to admire, someone to really respect and kind of model my life after for the most part. One word um, to describe Stephen, I, I guess it, actually it's more than one word, but it's a zest, a zest for life. He really um, is, loves life. He is enthusiastic about um, the things that he, he, um, he comes across, whether or not they're foods, or TV shows or music. Um, there are so many um, times when he says it's his favorite or it's all time or how much he loves somebody, something or somebody. Um, but he has exuberance for life. And um, he will put, when he finds something, which is often many things that he really enjoys, he throws himself wholeheartedly in it um, and immerses himself in it as much as possible.